Despite two arrests for violating his probation, the son of Mahoning County's juvenile court judge will not have to go to prison, but he must remain in treatment and continue his recovery. 27 First News reporter Jerry Ricciuti was the only reporter in court this afternoon. As John Delick told the judge, he's finally clean and sober and wants to stay that way. As his parents, including Mahoning County's juvenile court judge, sat behind him, prosecutors urged a judge to treat John Delick the way he would treat anyone else accused of violating probation. Uh, I think anyone else would be uh, placed in handcuffs and taken away to Lorraine Correctional. So that's what we're asking. Since the beginning of this year, the young Delic has been arrested twice for violating the terms of his release after being sentenced in February of last year on assault and felonious assault charges and placed on probation for 18 months. In April, Delic was caught with marijuana and ordered to begin an in-house treatment program. In court this afternoon, his caregivers told the judge Delic has been a model patient. He's been able to recognize uh, his shortcomings and character defects, and he's working through all these. Delic's father, who's also an attorney, says after years of trying to address his son's problems, his most recent arrest finally brought about the right course of treatment for both his addiction and his depression. We never had any idea of uh, that John was dealing with his, his, his mental health issues um, through substance abuse. When it was his turn to speak, the defendant told the judge he's finally on the right path. I have 64 days sober today, and I take it a day at a time because that's all I really have. Visiting Judge Michael Nunner agreed to allow Delic to continue with his counseling and treatment. People will be watching, and if you fail to meet the standards, um, that are expected, you know you'll be back here. As part of that, the judge also ordered Delic be subject to random drug testing to ensure he stays clean. In Youngstown, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.